Time now for News Extra and brought to you today by First State Bank. Here's Kevin. Thank you very much, Dennis. Good morning, everyone. We have Brad Sherman here today. Too bad we don't get him in here more than just once a year. We might have to try to get you in for something else because he's a good guest. Always talking about uh, dodgeball and uh, the tournament coming up to benefit the United Way on Saturday, March 12th over at the Bridgeport Community Center, the UPS-sponsored Double Elimination Dodgeball Tournament. So, sounds like fun, man. Oh, it's, it's going to be fun. This is our fourth year, so it's uh, we're drumming up a little bit more prize money this year with some more sponsors. So, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a pretty good event. All right. So, uh, uh, tell us what you got to do here. A uh, five-player team, is, uh, is that right? Yep, you just need... Five people, uh, game matches usually only last three or four minutes, and uh, uh, we're going to play a double elimination. We'll do a round robin uh, entry uh, into the tournament. So everybody's guaranteed at least at least two or three matches, if not more. Yeah, probably. And then uh, what, best record in the round robin, then you move on to the finals. Right, and then again, finals, huh? depending on how many teams we got, we might have a double elimination, single el- elimination finals. Okay, there's three divisions. And I'm sure the first two here, you get a lot more people than in the open one, right? Well, actually, the open and the younger kids are the ones we have the most. We've only had a couple high school teams. so Really? Yeah. All right. Junior high and under, high school and open. And open means Indeed. anybody over high school. Yep. If you're out of high school, you're in the open division. Wow. So, in other words, if we put together a team, we'd have to go against some kids from college or something, right? Yeah. Or, you know, who who knows? Yeah, <laughs> who, knows, who knows what age we have? Uh, we have all sorts of ages. It's it's pretty fun to watch. A lot of teams will put together a team with just their family, so that you got some some kids and some older uh, folks in the in the uh, match. So it's pretty yeah. fun. Yeah, sounds cool. So uh, there's prizes here that you can win as well. Absolutely, we've got uh, uh, different prizes. We have uh, John from Flatwater Arms has uh, given us a 22 lever action rifle. To raffle off also will be available there. Uh, we're going to do the drawing there at the at the event, but we can buy the tickets at uh, Flatwater Arms or Trail City Supply prior to that. Okay, and then uh, you also have a most creative uniform and MVP in each division, and and then we also have a championship in the last man standing event, last person standing. Going to be yeah, correct. Could on be that. a man or a woman. Right? That's right. And all these teams could be a man or a woman. Doesn't that's right. Yep. have to be five guys or five gals that can split them up? Nope, whatever there's no uh, no requirement on how many of each. Okay, sounds good. What's the cost for all this? Uh, it's $45 if you get your entry fee in uh, before, I believe, the 8th. Um, it'll be $45 per team. Otherwise, it's $50 the day of the event. We just want to try and get as many people registered so we got a pretty good idea how many people are coming. All right, Saturday, March 12th, over at the Bridgeport Community Center. It starts at uh, 10 a.m. Again, it's a... Double elimination tournament, so you're in for a while anyway, right? This this is true. Yeah, we're gonna go through the round robin brackets, and like I said, most teams will play at least at least three times. Yeah. Okay. Good deal. We'll talk more about this right after this break. Livestock never takes a day off. In the dead of winter, beef on the hoof still needs to eat. Hogs want to be watered on the Fourth of July. Dairy cows insist on being milked on Christmas morning. Come snow, wind, rain, or Sunday, livestock producers still have to do their chores. We make the financial side of it a little easier. We're a community ag bank and we're local. Stop by and see us. Let's talk. First State Bank. Member FDIC. When you grow, we grow. We are back on News Extra. We're talking about uh, the dodgeball tournament Saturday, March 12th, over at the Bridgeport Community Center at 10 a.m., the annual UPS dodgeball tournament to benefit the United Way. It's just $45 per team, five players per team. You remember playing dodgeball in school. You played it, Brad, I'm sure. I played it. Kind of toughened you up. Don't know whether they do a lot of it anymore i don't think from what i'm hearing it doesn't it doesn't happen a lot anymore i think it's a it's a good life skill to learn uh, dodgeball you learn a lot from that i think you do too <laughs> toughens you up a little bit right exactly yeah okay and i feel like i'm better now that i'm older i think i might not be but oh yeah <laughs> so does your team do pretty good in this well we uh i got a ups team that we uh have a tournament in sydney 
um, every year. We won it last year, but uh, haven't had a team in this Bridgeport one. So yeah, but, you're too busy organizing stuff, right? Yeah, it's just it's got to have time to do something. I guess <laughs> I get some. I got to squeeze some work in from okay. time to time. All right. So how do you get registered for this? Well, you can email me at uh, bdsherman at ups dot com. It's Brad Sherman at ups dot com without the R A. So it's uh, and then Pretty also. Easy. You got uh, my cell phone number, 249-2321. You can call me or email me, and uh, we'll get your team in there for 45 bucks and until three days before the event, and then it goes up to 50 All right. Very cool. And uh, you mentioned some of the sponsors you have here, Flatwater Arms and Trail City Supply, uh, out of, both out of Bridgeport. They've uh, contributed some money for the... For the winners, huh? That's right. And also, along with the, the subway there in, in Bridgeport, they've all uh, given us money so we can uh, give $150 for each first place division team, um, and then along with some other prizes that we'll be giving out throughout the day. Okay. Sounds like a lot of fun. Over at uh, the Bridgeport Community Center, 10 a.m. on Saturday, March 12th. So a week from this Saturday, you can participate in the United Way in the uh, UPS Dodgeball Tournament to benefit the United Way. You guys uh, raised some pretty good money for them last year? Yeah, I think we made over $600 last year and uh, looking to make uh, even more than that this year with yeah. some more teams and everything. Yeah, all right, fourth annual. Once again, to get involved, uh, just email Brad at bdsherman at ups.com or give him a call, 249-2321. Just $45 per team, five players on a team. All right. Thanks, bud. Yep. Thanks, Kevin.